In this video, I'll show you how to download and install Sozi on a Windows operating system. Just go ahead and search for Sozi. It's not the .com, it's this one that's .fr. And then we'll go ahead and click this 19.04 and scroll down and click on Install Sozi 19.04. It may be a later version, um, depending on the point in time you do it. Click on the Download Latest Release. And then we're going to click on this uh, Windows x64.zip. Apologize, you can't see my mouse cursor. Uh, go ahead and click Save File, and we'll just save this. And uh, I'm going to speed up the video till the till it's done downloading. The download will either be in the top right of your browser if you're using Firefox, or maybe the towards the bottom, bottom left, if you're using a, a different browser. Okay, that's finished being downloaded. Uh, we can either click on this folder here, and it'll open up the directory, or we can navigate to our uh, file explorer and go into Downloads. And then we just want to go to the file and right click on it. And you can either go to extract here, uh, or you can just click on the file. If you have 7-zip installed, you can also do extract here. It may look different depending on the uh, file extraction software you have on your computer. You can also just open it up potentially and click extract and OK. And then it'll take uh, just a minute to extract that. And what this is doing is just um, uncompressing those files and putting them in their own folder in the same directory as that .zip file. So we can close out of this and we can see this new uh, folder, this new Sozi folder, and we just scroll down and it's this Sozi application that we need to click on. And so we'll just open this and that's it. Nothing needs to get installed on the computer, it just runs locally uh, right from this directory. Wherever we move this folder is where it will go. And the first time you open, it's asking for a .svg file. And so if you have one of those, you can just choose it. Um, if not, um, you'll need to use something like Inkscape. And uh, in the next tutorials, we'll learn how to do that. Well, thanks for watching. Leave your questions in the comments below if you have them. And we'll catch you in the next video.